Hello everyone, this is Ricardo Review. I'm here today to review the Pure Lure Creek Dance. Mine is the 5.6, so 1.68 meters. I'm throwing the usual suspect because I see plenty of big fish in here. The creek is very, very low and I'm just coming as the cold front is approaching with some rain. I, of course, have the silver feather with me. Just make a cast. I don't know what you guys think about this combo. I think a round reel would match this rod perfectly. First one of the day. Very, very trashy. Can I? Yes. Just make a fast thumbnail. And I will send it free. Quick release. So I think I found the feeding window for them. It's from <coughs> 8 until maybe 9 after that it, the bite just dies but I felt this guy attack the lure like 2 or 3 times so very very hungry fish let's try the water pipe make a reset for the fish that are just under the water pipe I will send it my lure just a little bit down the creek let's see the casting on this rod I know that the reel is no problem So the cast weight on this rod it's one to seven grams, which means that this lure, the Bass Legends crankbait, it's bang on the middle at four and a half. Matt fail, it should be three and a half, but either way it's on the middle of the spectrum of the cast weights but you are able to cast this let's dial the brakes a bit more cast distance <clears throat> let's dial them even further to two I'm getting a lot of distance out of this rod and reel combo. <coughs> Going on the danger zone.
I told you it was the danger zone. <laughs> Funny, some small, small chop just coming out of right after the lure. <coughs> But you get plenty of distance. This is the family of these rods, as the name says, it's creek dance. Even if you are on a bigger creek, you will not have too many problems putting the lure where you want. I'm just lobbing. Yeah. I can put it wherever I want it. Let's try to catch some more fish. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Try really is the keyword. I went everywhere and anywhere in between, even to the main river, but no luck. I tried another lure, some soft plastics, but nothing was working. So we reached the end of the session today it was a very very quick one because it's weekend and on the weekends usually i don't fish i just came in here because i woke up early after was filming the unboxing of this rod sorry for the wind i will try, uh, try to take it out a little bit on editing but i just unboxed this yesterday until 2 a.m I even make a big big mistake that I will have to edit and you will see guys I was so sleepy that I missed I swapped the line rating for the lure rating so bit of a blunder over there uh, but this is a 127 gram casting rod perfect for the creek at 100 euros it's it's fair price if it's a 60 like now you have some models on super deals it's a steal it's the um, on first impressions i can tell you that this probably as a pure rule silver feather the best casting rod i own the fit and finish it's it's very 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 good um price per performance at full price it's over there with the uh, with the other stuff but on discount it's unbeatable I'll be testing this rod further and further if the weather permits it because we'll be having rain um, in a couple of days but this is one that will stay for me for the foreseeable future this one would for sure survive the spring cleaning but I really don't have much more time so until my next video I'll see you guys next time bye